Drones and unmanned vehicles, otherwise known as UAVs, are becoming an increasingly important part of modern warfighting. From precision strikes on targets in other continents to providing airborne reconnaissance for individual fire teams, drones are providing major force multiplication for comparatively minimal costs. But it's not just Western militaries that are recognising the new capabilities that UAVs bring. Their cheapness and utility has also been appreciated by various non-state actors, a graphic example being the use of drones by ISIS, which were provided with the ability to drop ordnance on unsuspecting targets. With the UAVs offering an inexpensive off-the-shelf precision strike capability, asymmetric warfare looks to become even more expensive to any force that has to deal with it. As a result, multiple companies are investigating ways to neutralise the threat such vehicles present. The Israelis, with a long history of dealing with unconventional threats to their security, have just demonstrated a new weapon that offers a counter. The Drone Dome system, developed by Raphael Advanced Defence Systems, is a counter-unmanned aircraft system that is designed to address threats posed by hostile drones to both military and civilian sites. Capable of being fitted with either directional jammers or a laser system capable of making a hard kill on target, on 12th of February, Drone Dome demonstrated the ability to shoot down multiple UAV targets in a test designed to simulate a swarm attack upon a facility. The system showed the ability to identify targets, then track and engage them. Additionally, the Drone Dome is a compact system with modular design, capable of being fitted to a vehicle as small as a standard civilian 4x4 truck. This in turn means the system offers additional benefits in terms of mobility and practicality for both military and civilian users. Raphael state that the Drone Dome is designed to complement their other anti-air and missile defence systems to provide a flexible and multi-layered protection from the evolving threat. That wraps up this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you are interested in military history and affairs, feel free to check out my website, militarymatters.online. I'll put a link in the description. Also, have a look at some of the other videos I've produced. You may find something else of interest. Check out some of the links coming up.